Hey, Calvary Plymouth. Welcome to today's Daily Devo, Psalm chapter 89. Let's look at verses 47 and 48. Remember how short my time is. For what futility have you created all the children of men? What man can live and not see death? Can he deliver his life from the power of the grave? So we get some information here that we all probably already know. We are going to die. What we do here on earth has a great effect on the people that are around us and also for eternity as well. Jesus told us in the book of Matthew, he said, lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven where moth and dust doesn't corrupt. So the things that we do here on this earth for the Lord are going to have a heavenly reward for us in eternity. But for now, we have to remember something. Maybe some of you are really young and you think you've got your whole life ahead of you. And, and you may have, but what are you going to do with that time? For some of us that are getting older and some that are close to that time, we can't remember or we can't think backwards and think about all the things that we could have, should have, would have done. We have to remember the time we have left. We need to invest in that time for Jesus. The next chapter in Psalm 90 says, you may have 70, maybe 80 years that God will give you. So wherever you're at in that time frame, focus on the Lord and focus on what he wants to do in you and through you on this earth and in this lifetime of yours. Listen, I've, I've done a lot of funerals, been to a lot of funerals, and it, it's a very sad time, especially for people that don't know the Lord or people that have lived a wasted life. But listen, we don't want to do that. Don't live that wasted life because there's going to be an amazing thing that will happen for believers. You'll stand in front of the Lord and he'll say, well done, thou good and faithful servant. So Father, we thank you so much for this time, Lord, that you remind us that our time is limited. So Lord, help us to invest. Help us to spend this time wisely. Lord, help us to bring glory and honor to you, Lord, to our families, Lord, to to be, a, to be an example and a legacy for our kids and our grandkids and for the future of all that you want to do on this earth. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, God bless you guys. We'll see you.